now with a stunning backdrop. The Queenstown Winter Festival is a highlight of the festival calendar. Along with the insane Undy 500, Birdman, the raft racing competitions, it's also well known for the best après ski entertainment with fireworks, balls, and of course, the best of New Zealand comedy, including the wonderful Justine Smith. Welcome to the cafe, Justine. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. Yeah. I have to say, um, fireworks and balls, two of my favourite things. So, <laughs> yeah, it's true. Yeah, who doesn't love fireworks and balls? Love them, love them all. Um, it's really nice to have you here. Thank we you. didn't get invited to it, so no. we're just having a bit oh, of a moan about that's that. All, yeah. That's embarrassing. Well, yeah, it is a bit, isn't it? But so, you must have to fight people off for this gig, yeah. though, do you? It's a very popular gig to be asked to do, let's put it, and I've got a good right throat punch. So <laughs> <laughs> some of those male comedians are at home crying. Um, no, it is pretty, it is, yeah, it's competitive. Yep. We do like to be asked to do it. And I always feel I've got a little bit of a show and being a South Island girl myself, it's returning home, talking to my peeps, you know. Plug that one for all your worth. Now, is it true that you tell people that you're actually a nurse and not a comedian when you meet them? Uh, no, only taxi drivers. <laughs> I've got a weird thing where um, if I'm in a taxi, I like to lie. And mainly that's because uh, if you tell someone you're a comedian, you can imagine what the next Say thing is. Say something funny. Yeah, and it's like, I did, it makes me feel a bit violent. So um, <laughs> I, I, I have pretended I'm a nurse a couple of times, once to a police officer, but I don't really want to tell that story right here on daytime TV. Um, <laughs> yeah, that's a long time. Well, but hang story. on, hang on. Does that work? Because you, you have been doing this for so long now. So it makes long. you sound old. Uh, no, I, it? I am old. Yeah. I am. It makes me tired just to care about it, actually. But people must recognise your face, do they? Yeah, they do. I mean, I a little bit. And Countdown the other day, someone, women, and shrieked in my face and I got a fright she got a fight because she'd seen me on seven days but there's no need to shriek at countdown you know <laughs> she scared me and a few children <laughs> excellent I oh, know you get sometimes you get hecklers at your shows don't you but you don't suffer them you take them to task well I don't I have this thing where I don't really get heckled that much and I think it's because a lot of heckles are from guys because you know uh, yeah. and um, <laughs> I think that a lot of guys are a little bit afraid to heckle me because they don't want to be put down by a woman in front of all their mates and you'd be good at that too that is definitely something that will happen. Good. Well, okay, so um, Winter Festival, what's on the cards for you when you're down there? What do you do? Do you just shimmy around drinking mulled wine or are oh, you actually there's, working? There's a lot of that. There's a, there's a, there's a small comedy set packed in between the boozing. And um, I have been known to snowboard, but really I just get the ski lift up to the bar and that's, you know, it's enjoy the view and watch other people hurt themselves. <laughs> so, yeah, we're doing two, two, two road. Is that me? <laughs> I was thinking oh, that you. It could be me. <laughs> I did a lot of stuff in the 90s I can't remember. That could be me, to be honest. Oh, actually, you know what I have done? The, I have done that undie oh, run. Oh, have you? Yeah. Not in my undies, though, because, God, no one wants to see that, do they? But, um, yeah, I could... What about the Birdman? You ever done that? No, Jump off the wharf? I could use my undies for the Birdman for, <laughs> like a, for some kind of, like, you know, like, huge sale thing. No, um, so if we want to see you in Queenstown, how do we go about it? You get some tickets to the comedy show and you come right along. It's hosted by Paul Ego and Jeremy Elwood and the guests are Di Henwood, James Nikise, the wonderful Sarah Devsich and myself. So we do two shows. We were going to do one, but the first one sold out. So nice. get in. there's Paul Ego now looking ridiculous. Oh, there you go, because the Seven Days crew are going to be there too. Are they sort of involved as well? Um, not so much in a Seven Days capacity. Oh, no, are they doing a record? I don't know. No one tells me anything. Well, let's um, just say the best comedians will be there. That's correct. Yes. Myself. Yeah, yeah. that's yeah. right. Nice. The absolute best. Hey, Ju thank you so much. I was going to be just been there, but you can't talk to me about you houses. Can, you can call me what Justine, you like. Justine, thank you so much. Uh, the Thanks, Queenstown Bill. Winter Festival opens on Thursday, the 22nd of June. For more details, you can head along to their website, winterfestival.co.nz.